Discipline is more about eliminating than it is adding. And what I mean by that is we often look at these people who are super disciplined and we think, oh, they were born this way. Like I, I wasn't born with that shit. And I'm the same way. Until I started to realize that you actually are born with a form of discipline. It's just things take it away from you, right? Like maybe you're on social media way too much. TikTok, it, it takes your discipline. Maybe it's YouTube. Maybe it's junk food. There's these things that actually steal it. And you could try and add as much discipline you want in your life, but think of it this way. If you had a bucket and it had holes in the bottom, and you know the water you're dumping in, that's discipline. You can add as much as you want, but if you don't patch up the holes on the bottom, it, you're never gonna retain it. It's gonna slip, and that's why so many people fail, myself included, is they never patch the holes, so they just keep trying to add the discipline. So the first thing you need to do is address the root of the problem. What are the things that are taking your discipline in the first place? And these are fundamental things, right? Like, like I was saying, maybe you're on your phone too much. You need to come up with a system. You need to avoid willpower and you need to come up with a system. So maybe you give the friend, your friends change your login for your social media and then you delete it on your phone and then you get it back maybe on weekends, you don't, you don't need to make it this thing that you will never do again in your life, unless it's terrible. Like, dude, if you're, if you're doing crack, you, get, you gotta remove that shit. But if it's like something like social media, maybe you get it back on uh, Sundays and you can set up a system there. You know, same thing with drinking. Maybe you, you limit yourself to once a month or once every two months, three months, whatever it is, you gotta find a system that actually works. And the best way to remove the things that are taking your discipline is to remove the things that would make you want to do them, if that makes sense. So for instance, if you have a problem with drinking, get rid of all the booze in your house. Don't hang around people who drink. That's, that's going to make your life way easier. Another one is if you're trying to eat clean, don't buy junk food. Throw the junk food away that's in your house. It's going to make eating clean easier because the temptation, the, the source, the, the trigger, it's not there. Same thing if you're trying to stop playing video games. Like if you're trying to quit video games, sell it. Like it's it's the easiest way. And I get it, maybe you don't wanna hear it, but it's gonna be the best way to stop playing them. It's just to remove it. You know, same thing for me. I haven't zinned in like 25 days. And I haven't even had a, like an urge to do so. And the reason being is A, I'm not around people who zin, and B, I just don't have zins. You just don't even think of it. It, it kind of becomes like a memory of the past. So the easiest way to gain discipline is to remove the things that are taking it. You know, a lot of times you got to address the, the bad habits before you try and add in the right ones. If you're trying to go to the gym and eat clean, but you just watch TV all day and you're trapped in social media, like you got to eliminate the things first to add them. So the things my challenge would be to you is what are the three worst habits you have in your life? And what's the best way that you could remove that cue, right? Maybe it's removing the app on your phone. Like I said, throwing the junk food away, selling the council, the TV, whatever it is. What are the three things that you could address in your life? And how could you remove the temptation? How could you make it harder on yourself to perform the habit? And then just by doing those things, you add discipline. And then you just plug in the things you want to do. But like I said, first you got to eliminate before you add. And this is something that helps me out. I hope it can help you out. I'll see you guys in the next one.